Yo, what is up, boy games out there? The name is Tekken Heat, bringing you guys a couple snapshots of the Crew Wild Run gameplay that I did get off of the Black Panther. So far, he is the only one that I have seen with this gameplay. So, if you guys want, I will leave his channel in the description down below. But now, what are we looking at here? Well, when I looked at the Crew Wild Run, obviously, the first thing I noticed was that everything looked visually amazing like they did mention that they were going to improve the graphics to improve the quality of the crew but I didn't think it was going to be like this now yeah it's not like no Forza or something outrageous like that but looking at it and looking at how the crew is at the moment you can definitely see a big big change and i am very excited to see it now what i'm also excited to see is that we got to get a demo of a couple of the new things that are coming in such as the drift spec which are the snapshots that you're seeing at the moment with the new brz which i cannot wait to drive can't wait to get that thing perfed out drift out um now we didn't see any customizations being done but i'm pretty sure that it will be just as similar to the perf specs now it was described with the drifting that it's a combination of how the physics are now in the crew and to how hot pursuit 2012 was which sadly i did not play that game although it didn't appeal to me greatly but at least i have an idea just by looking at this gameplay that there is a slight skill to doing these drifts even though the the specs are more geared to it i am happy to see though that there is a skill slightly and not no break you know tap the brake to drift like you would see in like rivals or something like that now what else we're seeing right now is actually a monster truck yes there are monster truck specs this is a ford raptor and the event that black panther is doing right now is a point test and or point challenge and what it is is that there are a whole bunch of points all throughout this ridiculous area that you would probably see out of fast and i mean not fast and furious out of um hot wheels and he said that you can do all sorts of tricks you can do back flips front flips uh it's pretty freaking amazing and looking at all the stuff around here i cannot wait to access it in the free room which he did confirm that even in free roam, you can go throughout this area. So I can definitely see this being very popular, just filled with monster trucks all around. So that is something that's gonna be pretty damn exciting. Now, what you'll be seeing in a little bit will be a couple of drag races going on. Now, he did mention that the drag racing, you can kind of relate it to Need for Speed Pro Street because they have a burnout session where pretty much you gotta warm up the tires the more uh, what well you do is going to be like how much more grip you can get. He did say like the first green light that you see is the one that you want to be revving your engine to. I do wonder though if that second green, uh, if that's also another area that you can do, if that will actually make your tires a bit more grippy. He says that since he, you know, just started this, that he was a bit inexperienced with it. Uh, and obviously it's also going to be a manual shifting and stuff. So that I cannot wait and the cars will go very freaking fast like that one went about I think 268 something similar some somewhere around that ballpark now what you're seeing now is actually something very surprising that I did not think was ever going to be in the crew and that is motorcycles so I'm very excited to see motorcycles there are in different specs do we have them in the street perf dirt um circuit raid which i'm curious to see what the raid specs are going to look like with motorcycles it's going to be pretty interesting but he was also showing us how um just taking like a circuit spec bike off road it can great it can greatly change uh the handling to your car it will definitely slow it down so the specs do matter even with the bikes and now what we're seeing now is something pretty damn exciting that i'm really I cannot wait to start doing and that is creating your own waypoint races now he was showing uh, different check that you could set your own checkpoints 
um, when heading to a destination. And then you could just race your mates to the finish line. And then in the middle of certain areas, you can actually have the ability to change your specs, which is actually pretty exciting because I don't want to be going, I don't want to be having like a waypoint from road to off-road when all I have is just a circuit spec. I think that would be pretty unfair. So I'm glad to see that Ivory Towers has just made this look extremely worth the buy i cannot wait till it comes out i'm definitely getting it i do so believe you can buy this thing separately i think it still comes out on a disc but i do believe that you can buy this separately um you can also buy it along with the crew i'm not sure what the price range is going to be but i'm pretty sure we'll get information on that in the future so let me know what you guys think I would definitely put Black Panther's channel in the description so you can actually see the gameplay. And yeah, till next time, this has been your boy Taking Heat, and I am out. Peace.